at Pathways, we work with people with loss and grieving, and I reflected that the squirrel's mate was going through the stages of loss and grieving right in front of my face. So I videotaped. And you can see that the squirrel is going through the stages of grieving, which starts with denial. And you can see him moving around and like, hey, get up, let's go, let's go. And when the squirrel doesn't move, he kind of turns around and comes back and tries some more, you know, hey, come on, let's go, let's go. And so the other stages are anger, depression, bargaining, and those kind of happen in you know different orders for different people and, and different models. And then, you know, the end of that is we move kind of we uphill from a trough, you know, we sink into the sadness, the anger and the bargaining. And we have to work way, our way out of this kind of trough of loss and grieving. And, you know, it's an upward uphill battle and often we're going up the hill and then, you know, we kind of slide back down. And we're down there doing the bargaining, doing the, you know, the denial, the anger, the depression, you know. And when this girl goes up in the tree, he uh, screams and cries. So you can hear the sadness. In the air. And so, you know, being caught in this round and round that creates a circular action, circular motion of feeling, you know, really, uh, you can see the squirrel over and over again trying the same things. And, you know, the animal part of us, uh, as, as humans, you know, go through the same process. And, you know, it illustrates why it's important to get help, to have someone to help you, to, you know, hey, what do I do now, you know? Wow, I'm feeling this way. And I really don't want to feel this way forever, you know? And it feels like it may last forever when we're just caught in that trough. You know, and you can see the squirrel is just like, I don't know what to do and keeps trying the same things over and over again, moving in circular motions, being upset about what's happening. And so, you know, this really uh, helped me reflect on how at Pathways we help people rise to a higher level of humanity because, you know, it's important when we lose something. So this could be anything, a loss, you know, as in death of a loved one or a loss of a job, a house, a car, anything. And, you know, we still go through this. And it's important for our bodies and our involuntary nervous system to go through this process so it won't continue to inhibit our ability to live our lives going forward. You know, and a big component of moving up out of the trough is the acceptance and the honoring of whatever we lost. You know, if you lose something, you had to have it to lose it. And so we want to honor what we had and move into love and realize that, you know, what we had is part of us. We have nerves that house the existence of that in our lives. And so we want to honor and love that and not be angry and upset with it because it's actually part of us. And so at Pathways, we give you some uplifting energy, some love energy to love what you had and love yourselves, to move through it, to be neurally empowered and live at a higher level of humanity.